Hey guys, Sculpts here, and today we are going to be making multiple characters from, you guessed it, Among Us. You pick your color, and you get one of these little guys, and off you go. You get put on three maps, but I heard that more maps will be coming very, very soon. That's exciting. And you complete various tasks while hopefully not dying. It sounds incredibly simple, but you have no idea who the killer is because he walks among us. It's a parasite, it's a freaky alien, it's... I don't know, maybe it's your next door neighbor, who knows? Who knows, it's a guessing game, it's all up in the air. Now, this game is seriously taking everything by storm. I did not expect it to be get to just be this popular it's it's crazy you're seeing among us everywhere and for it being a very simple game and for it being developed by I think a th it's like a really small team I think it's like three people who made this game I think it's great I honestly do I, th I think I think it's great you know it's not just big companies that can make games that are really, really enjoyable. And this game proves that. There's, it's simplistic, it's endearing, it's great, and it's terrible when you are always, always dying to the imposter because you can't, you can't figure it out or you're distracted by stuff on the map. And you just want to explore, and then you realize, well, somebody's hunting you. Just... Ooh. Anyway. Here we're making blue. Um, one problem I have with blue is that he does not stand up. Not for long. So, blue's drunk. So, obviously, blue's not the imposture. If you've had... Blue be the imposter. I apologize. I guess he wasn't drunk enough because my blue is always drunk. He will not stand up, unfortunately. But that's okay. The thing that makes this game so difficult is that everybody looks the same. I mean, yes, you can get little accessories, little hats, a little pet which basically just looks like a mini me it's like austin powers all over again but that's the thing is that it's hard to tell who among us <gasps> has an evil bone if you want to call it an evil bone i'm not really sure now I never could figure this out, but what do they keep in their backpacks? Like, is it even a backpack or is it just oxygen tank? Something to ponder about. I don't know. Might be thinking too much into it, but I explored the internet and I found that some people have these really crazy theories about a very very simple game and I love it I just I love it because it goes to show that that big companies aren't the only ones that can make really really enjoyable games for people now on green I did not have enough so I had to make his backpack out of aluminum foil now does that make him the imposter I don't know maybe he doesn't have to breathe if the backpack actually has your oxygen tank and everything in it and this one just has aluminum foil I guess green could be the imposter is green the imposter I don't know I guess we'll have to wait and see uh, what is your favorite color to play as in this game and are you better at completing the tasks as a simple crewmate, or do you love being the imposter and sneaking around stalking fellow players? Let me know in the comments below, and 
I don't know what I'm going to do with the information, but, you know, honestly, just have a conversation about this incredibly simple but fun game. It's great. If you enjoy it, yes. If you've never played it, that's okay. That's okay. I mean, you don't have to play it. You can just watch gameplay footage of it on YouTube if you want. I mean, not everybody shows footage of them playing the game. Some people just do s unique stuff. Like, one guy had a ton of pets following him in different colors, which is basically just a mini version of you in different colors. And he did, like, these patterns. And they followed him all around the map. It's it's great. It's creative. It's... Some people would say it's the height of boredom, but... Aren't games here just to have fun? Isn't that the important aspect of it? I think so. And here we're making pink. I asked my friend who he thinks is the imposter and he said pink and I asked him, why, why, why pink? Like, why would pink always be the imposter? And he just goes, oh, well, you know, it's pink. And rude, that's, that's called being a pinkist. How dare you be racist against pink? Not cool, dude. Not cool. But is pink the imposter? <gasps> we do not know. Bum bum bum. I realized later on when I was baking these guys that orange is a bit skinny. I thought I made them the same size as everybody else, which you know, most of these guys do look the same. Some of them don't. But I see now that orange is too skinny. I guess that's why people always send him into the vents. You know, he can get into those hard to reach places to do stuff. Now, who has finished all their tasks? Just, you know, if you're a crewmate, who actually successfully finished all their tasks without getting killed? I mean, I think that's crazy hard. But then again, I don't play PC games that much or that often. Occasionally, yes. Is yellow the imposture? We don't know. Let's make black. <gasps> Is black the imposter because he has a little bit of gray in there? Mm. He's looking a bit marbled. Does that make him the imposter? <gasps> dun dun dun. Or does he just want to stand out amongst his fellow crewmates? Or? Or is it dirt? Or is it snow? We will never know. We will never know. So the exciting news is that huh, white stayed white. That That's the difficult part with white clay is keeping it clean. But I'm pretty sure I did get it dirty. Maybe I just can't see it. Who knows? Who knows? But no, that was not the exciting news. Um, the, ex <laughs> the exciting news is that more maps have been announced for Among Us, and I think that's that's great. Yes, it was created by a small team. I think only the three people are behind it, so it's an indie studio. But I think I think it's great. I think it's great that their game like really kicked off and it's really popular, and people enjoy it as much as they do. Oh, here's purple, my favorite color. I love purple. But, is purple the imposter? <gasps> dun, dun, dun. If you want to see me make more of these little guys with accessories, let me know. If not, you know, we'll just keep them basic and simple. I mean, if you want to get into clay sculpting and you want to start with something simple that you can do in like a really short amount of time and be like really really proud of what you did because you can carry these guys in your pocket you can start by creating these guys 
these little crewmates. And you can pretend that maybe you're carrying around the imposter. Or maybe you're c carrying around the sole survivor. <gasps> dun dun dun! Here's brown. No, it's not chocolate. Doesn't really look like chocolate. I don't know. On the back of the clay package, it says it's caramel, and I go, it doesn't look like caramel. Hmm. Now, there's a lot of debate on this color as to what it's actually called. Some people go turquoise, some people go light blue, other people say cayenne, who knows, you know, I don't think any of them are wrong, just pick whichever color and you're good to go. But this guy's light green and I think he's friends with black because he's a little bit marbled too. Marbled. Anyway, and he has the smallest backpack of all of them. Hmm, is he the imposter? <gasps> we don't know. Oh, and here we're gonna make visors. Uh, yeah, I'm cutting so many pieces and I don't even need them because I just, you know, cut them in half and that's, that's good enough size. So I, had some clay left over. That's okay. See? Doesn't he look awesome? Yeah, he does. Look. There's all of them. I realize now that this looks like they're going to perform a ritual. Or maybe they're going to do a flash dance mob thing. Huh. Those don't happen anymore. <gasps> Freshly baked! Pick your favorite color. Here's red. Very simple. And there's blue. See, blue's drunk. He's drunk. Green. Pink. Orange. Da da da. And more of them are coming. These guys were fun to make. So simple. I should have probably done some hat accessories or mini versions. Hmm. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. So, who do you think is the imposter? <gasps> dead body reported. Who's dead? <gasps> no! They got orange! Wait. Wait. Gray? Gray? Where did he come from? He's not even sorry. <gasps> Thank you for watching. <laughs> I'll see you next time. <laughs>